Testing one, two, three, seven, 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 seven. A good friend of mine told me, use seven, the word seven, to check out a microphone. So that's what I'm doing right now. How does this sound? Now I'm going to change microphones and go to a different microphone. You ready? Testing one, two, three, test, test. Now this is a lavalier microphone that I got on the internet for $1.50. That's this one right here. See that? Testing one, two, seven, 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 seven. This is the lavalier mic that I got with my Tascam DR10L. So I'm just checking this out to see what it sounds like in this uh, video format. I'm using my camera up there. Ding, ding. Um, it's got a really wide lens on it. So you can see my keyboard right here. Uh, in fact, let's play the keyboard just for a second, okay? Let's see what it sounds like. To a different sound. There we go. Check, test. Ooh, <laughs> you know what? I really like this SM57 because it's just it's a really good stage mic and I can uh I can just work with it really well. I can get it really close to my face. There's hardly any noise and I just I just like it. <laughs> so I think I'll just go ahead and use this SM57. Sure microphone. Okay. Um so this is a Beethoven Sonata Opus 49 number 1 and uh then I'm going to put on the screen this, which is um, Tears in Heaven. And Tears in Heaven is a, is a wonderful piece. You know, it's a fantastic piece of music by Eric Clapton. So we're going to talk about uh, the treble clef and bass clef and guitar tab a little bit and just uh, explain a little bit about how tablature works and how uh, music notation works. We're going to go pretty fast because I'm not going to sit here and, and detail it too much to you. Um, but I just wanted to just check in with you today. Um, we've been a little busy. My wife had uh, a retinal tear in her eye. I had to take her down to the doctor this morning. And so uh, she got part of a procedure today and she has to go in tomorrow and do some laser surgery uh, on that eye. So um, that's been kind of interesting. Uh, my brother-in-law passed away about three weeks ago, and that was a shock to the family. Well, it, it wasn't COVID, by the way. It was something else. Um, he had Alzheimer's, the late stages of Alzheimer's. He wasn't too much older than me. He was only a couple of years older, but he also had um, uh, diabetes and had has had that for years and years. We were kind of expecting that. We come into this life, we go out of this life, uh, my daughter had a baby, when was it, at the end of November, and my daughter-in-law, my son's wife, had a baby uh, two or three weeks later. <laughs> I'll have to look at the date. I think it was like two weeks later. We, I am done here. We are not going to do anything right now. I'm going to, I just want to see what the the quality sounds like. Thank you for being my supporters. Uh, you know that I have both a Patreon page and I have a Subscribestar page. Subscribestar is not as uh, advanced as Patreon because they haven't been around as long. Also, I don't get your emails uh, automatically, your email address, so I have to ask for it. I think this is something new that they've done, so I'm going to ask for everybody's email that's a subscriber to me so that I can put you on my email list so that if you leave Subscribestar, we can still keep in touch and I can send you updates to my book because... I haven't decided yet, but if you're a, a subscriber and you've been a subscriber for a while and you have a certain amount of money that you've donated to me, I'm just going to give you updates. And if you get to like 50 bucks or something like that, I'm going to give you updates for quite a while because I think it's worth that much. And, you know, even when it's up to four or 500 pages, you will get, uh, and the same thing with Patreon people and the same thing with people who just uh, donate to me through PayPal. I don't have an automatic link yet, but... Um, 
I've just been busy and haven't done it. And I wasn't sure I wanted to do it, and maybe I do. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for coming along. You will see me in another video very soon. We'll talk to you later.